Y concluyen los primeros capítulos de estos tres personajes. Yo creo que seguimos por orden, ¿no? Con John Smith, Laguna, capítulo 2, trastorno de personalidad múltiple. Previously on Last Stop. Dad! I know, I'm running late. Let me get sorted, I'll be quick. What's the deal with Jack's post always coming to us? Uh, do you have any post for us? Ah, uh, yeah, I do. You know? You see that? I couldn't even bother to bring me my damn post. I like him. Oof. Are you guys all right? You too, you too. We're made for each other. Está gracioso, me mola, me mola. Vale, a ver, ¿cómo vamos a mantener esta conversación? Será un poco raro. Molly, you're okay. Are you here to see my dad? I think he's sick. Yeah, can you let me in? Okay, I guess I'm not a traitor. He's locked himself in his bedroom. Thanks. Dios mío. Esos son los ruidos que hace Carazón mientras caga. Oh God. Oh God, what the hell has happened to me? Jack, please say that's you in there. Come in here. What the hell's going on? Why do I look like a terrible, fat old man? All right, tone it down a notch. My daughter's out here. Who the hell are you? Why do you sound like me? Open the door. Jesus H. Christ! You've stolen my body! I don't want it. Give me my body back. Wait. I thought I recognized this face in the mirror. If this is your body, that must make you the bloke who brings the post! Seriously? My name's John. We've met like ten times. Look, this is not important right now. Help! Shut up! No! What the hell are you doing? Really? Your dad's a little bit unwell. So I'm going to take you to school. That's all right, isn't it? Sure. What's <laughs> wrong with my dad? Qué risa, cabrón. Oh, he just has an upset stomach. Nothing serious. He probably just ate some... gone off meat or something. He was screaming because of an upset stomach. Maybe it was that jelly. Could be. Is Dad going to have to go to a hospital again? No. He'll be back to normal in no time. Just... He has to go to the doctor about his heart sometimes. Una pena, la verdad. Trust me, Mo. He'll be fine. You've never called me Mole before. Will you make sure Dad's okay when I'm at school? He can't have fried food. He isn't allowed. Well, I'm just going to pop home after this to check on him. Or cheesecake. He'll ask you for it by saying no. Okay, Molly. Hey, Molly. Hello, whoever you are. Hey, Shaz, this is Jack. Hello, Jack. Molly, where's your dad? He's not feeling well. Jack said he did number two all around his bedroom. Then he walked me to school. Oh, ooh. Thanks for that colourful interpretation there. He, he's, he's fine, he's just a bit ill. Who are you again? I told you, he's Jack. Molly. Why don't you run along to school? Okay. Okay, what's really happened to John? And why the hell are you taking his daughter to school? Okay, 
I can explain. You better. I'm calling the police. I'm, uh, John's nephew. That doesn't make sense. He's an only child. You know John doesn't like opening up about that sort of stuff. Look, if you don't believe me, ask me something only someone close to John would know. I'm not playing games. Well, por favor. Please. Well, what's John's mum called? Roberta Smith. Biggest phobia? Cotton wool. Can't stand the feel of it. You're really John's nephew. I am. Look, I'm, I'm glad I bumped into you, actually. He asked whether you could tell Clive he won't be in today. He's going to be in the shit for that. But sure, I can tell him. Thanks, Shaz. Uh, Sh Shazia. I appreciate it. John's so fragile. I often say he could use some help around the house. Well, not that fragile. Anda, logro. Bambacophobia. Como John admite tener una fobia rara. Ah, right. Interesante. You're not going to scream at me again, are you? Dime que no se ha ido, verdad? Se ha ido. He's done a runner. <laughs> <laughs> A ver, um, Jack, ¿dónde estás? Aquí hay un tío eh, raro que sabe mi nombre y no para de hablar de ti. ¿Quién es? Esta es la chica de... Jack, what the hell? Do you know this guy? Amy, it's me! I'm Jack! I work with him. Sorry. He suffers from a terrible sleepwalking disorder. I wouldn't wake him. Could be dangerous. How does he know my name? He's lying! Amy, it's me! We've been friends forever! Oh, uh... I guess I told him about you. Why? What did you tell him? Oh, you know, just that you're really nice, that you're a nice person, that you're really good at running. Your favourite ice cream's rum and raisin, your favourite sport is basketball, you secretly smoke, but you never tell anybody. Shut up! Did you seriously tell him all this shit about me? No. I, um, keep a diary. And he read it. The bastard. Oh, well. I'll look after him. Why don't you go to, uh... Work? Don't go! Amy! Amy, help me! I need your help! Right. Well, see you later. Yeah. Bye. Amy! Jack, stay away from me. Bueno, estamos en buena forma, así que. Bell on me or something. You're evil. No hay problema. Will you stop a minute? We need to talk about this. Just leave me alone. My body feels so weird. Jesus, don't you ever exercise? Slow down. You'll give me another heart attack. Tranquilo, que no te va a dar ningún ataque al corazón. Le dejan entrar con un pijama. Have you got any idea how this might have happened? No. Oddly enough, this is my first time swapping bodies. Something would have triggered this. 
Something that connects the two of us. Something spiritual. Or witchcraft. No, I don't believe in any of that crap. Jesus. What are they going to say at work? Well, I'm you, right? I've got your phone here. Let me call in sick for you. Actually, not a bad idea. Okay, look for Sonia in my contacts. She's the receptionist at work. Tell her I've got the squits or something. Charming. Okay. It's ringing. Superfab Games. Sonia speaking. Hey, Sonia. It's Jack. Uh, I'm not going to be able to make it in today because I got the squirts, I'm afraid. Ah, oh, Skyver. No worries, I'll tell Derek. Enjoy your lion. Oh, there it went now. No, really. I'm very poorly. She hung up. Yeah. So you safe. Madre mía, ya más de este día real. Ah, va, pues no pasa nada. Disfruta el día. Bueno, no. Adelante. Ya. Ya, así, ya. Ok, thanks. Well, where's your daughter's school? I said to let them know in future if you plan to keep Molly home for the day. Such an idiot. I shouldn't have taken her to school. She must have been so confused about everything. Well, you did drop her off in my body. I mean, she possibly thought that was a little bit weird. Shut up and help me look for her. Hey, relax. Look, she's probably just in the park, right? Playing on the swings, like, you know, like a kid. You need to chill out. Really? You're telling me to chill out? After that whole performance earlier? Come on! Let's go to the park, then. It feels seriously weird being you. Ugh. Everything jiggles about as I move. Can you focus on the matter at hand? My daughter may have been kidnapped. Mate, she's probably just drinking cider behind a tree somewhere. She's eight. Oh. Alcohol-free cider? Aquí está. Está, está bastante de risa la, la historia. Y se nota la diferencia entre cada personaje. No, distintos temitas. Esta es más graciosa la historia de este, de este tío. Oh, hi Jack, nice to see you. This is going to take some explaining. So I didn't go to school. Am I in trouble? What? Nah, we're cool. No worries. Molly, promise me you'll never do that again. You scared me to death. Why are you both being so weird? Dad, I was worried you were poorly, so I wanted to go home. But then I got scared you'd be angry. Are you going to tell her or am I? There's something we need to talk to you about. Vale, va a ser un poco raro decirle esto a una niña. How come Jack's here? I think you should ask John that. I, I, I mean, Jack. We have something to tell you that affects all three of us. Is it about our post? Eh, no. <laughs> no sobre el correo ni ni tampoco es nada de 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 que estamos juntos. So, something seems to have happened last night where um how would you describe it? <laughs> Parece muy raro. Our brains have got swapped. What he's trying to say is that we seem to be in each other's bodies. I'm me. Your dad. And that makes me Jack, not dad. Makes sense? You've swapped brains? Yes. And you're my dad? Yeah. And this isn't a joke? No. Okay. Chicken dippers. Solid dinner choice, John. They're the business. So, what happens now? Well, see, now you have two papas. <laughs> Get our old bodies back. All oh, right, Dad, you've got a sauce down your front. That shirt's limited edition. So I have. That's a shame, isn't it? Don't worry, Jack. Plenty of my clothes have got all sorts of stains on them. You oh. both have a bit of a stain. You should dress each other up properly. She's got a point. 
None of my clothes are going to fit me anymore. Okay, we'll go get my stuff, but I want them back in the same condition I left them. She's a smart kid. I know. I'm a lucky dad. How do you put up with feeling out of breath all the time? By avoiding as much physical exertion as possible. Así que nada de ñaca ñaca es una pena, pero es lo que hay. We're gonna have to perform a wardrobe transplant on you. Go and get some clothes from the wardrobe in my bedroom. Madre mía, tú la silla que hay, muchacho loco. <risa> mira, mira el setup. Yo de, de, de aquí, como mínimo, me llevaría las dos luces y, y un segundo monitor. Que ya tengo dos monitores, pero es que este, el que tengo aquí, es malísimo. Muy malo, de verdad. Muy malo. Y seguro que esa webcam es... Es buena. Madre que lo parió. Solo tengo tres camisetas. ¡Uh! Me quedo con esta. Hombre. Ah, no, tengo más ahí, pero bueno, que tengo pocas igualmente. Está guapa la camiseta, eh. Jack, everybody thinks you're me. It'll look too suspicious if I'm alone with Molly. So what are you saying? You want me to move in? Yeah. The more I think this through, the more problems there are. What about work? I can't keep calling in sick. I'm guessing you have a job too. En realidad tiene, tiene razón. La marca del monitor este es Samsung. ¿Vale? O sea, el que no es muy allá. So what do we do? Pero bueno, porque es un monitor normalito. I'm gonna have to pretend to be you. And you're gonna have to pretend to be me. Clásico en las películas de cambio de cuerpo. Oh, yeah. Vamos con la espía que uh, mantiene relaciones sexuales con el vecino. Y, y bueno, está casada y tiene un hijo que le gusta leer libros sin letras y sin dibujos. Una, es una lectura fácil, la verdad. I've decided to include Amy in the selection process. Let's see who comes out on top. De momento la primera conexión que hemos visto es eh, bueno a Amy en, en el capítulo de del hombre gordo y calvo. Clásicos pisos. de Inglaterra. Hey dad. How's life inside the military industrial complex? Blown up any babies with your death robots this week? I see you're back in good spirits. All I see in the news these days is robots. Robots killing people, robots taking jobs, robots having sex with people. You know, in my day, we'd have balloted if someone tried to give a job to a bloody robot. Strong industrial action is what we need. How's the ticker? You've been doing your exercises like Dr. Lund recommended? That's another thing that's gone to the dogs. The state of the health service in this country. Okay, before you get deep into another one of your rants, do you fancy going for a walk? Oh, Nini, you're just trying to shut me up? Well, I won't fall for it. I guess I'll feed the pigeons without you then. Hmm. Well, don't dawdle. Lead on. Why do I never get to see my grandson? Sé cómo manejar a mi padre. Dad, he visits you at least once a month. But you come over here every day. And aren't you lucky to have such a devoted daughter? Hmm. 
Your allotment doing okay? Bastards took it away from me. Christ's sake. What did you do this time? The fascist closed ranks and forced me out. Didn't have the stomach for my radical proposals. And there it is. Here you go, comrades. Get your beaks around this manky old bread. Dad, I've got a question. I call these two Tony and Alistair. Mangy old bear. Was it always... easy being married to Mom? What? I don't know, I was just wondering. You and Mum were married for 40 years. That's a long time to be with one person. Where did you get that idea? Our marriage was strong. Your mother shone like gold. You know, she saw the beauty in all things, Nini. No matter how cracked and broken. <laughs> Spending 40 years seeing the world through her eyes was a privilege. She was always so patient with us. Do you remember that mobile we made together? The <laughs> one I tore down in the strop. <laughs> Seabirds of the British Isles. I got it from the RSPB. Oh, your mother loved coming here to feed the birds. You know, everything took a turn for the worse when she left us. Yeah. But we all have to push forward. You had a loving family. <laughs> I don't know why you turned out like you did. It's getting on. We should head back. <laughs> Had enough of me, I see. Okay. Take me home. I, uh, imagine you're in a hurry to get back to work. No, I'm done for the day. Good. We'll have time for a couple then. Suerte con la operación, Carazor. Nos vemos más tarde. O mañana. You know, Julia from the book club. Y nos presumirás de, de dentadura potente. ¿Cómo hacen ellos el té? It's an insult, to Holy be honest. Shit. And if you want a holiday, you can have a weekend in Wales like the rest of us. Oh, esto es un café. Se supone que es que es que como son ingleses, pues. Don't be shy. Uno no sabe. A little more sugar than that. Keep it coming. A little more. Seriously. Mmm, galletas de chocolate. ¡Oh! Mi padre se droga. No. What is this? Madre mía. <ríe> y cachando, eh. Hijo de Dios. No parecen ocultar nada a nadie. Vale, sin objetos ocultos. Se podría decir que he encontrado todo su alijo. Sin señales de intervención telefónica tampoco. La policía no ha dado con el primero. Sin irritación, pupilas no dilatadas, sin señales residu residuales de embriaguez. Parece estar en su sano juicio, al menos según los estándares de papá. Edificio expuesto con grandes ventanas, vulnerable a la vigilancia externa, líneas de visión oscurecidas. Riesgo de reputación personal, aceptable. Is this what I think it is? Put it away, poking around in other people's business. These are drugs. Class A drugs. Oh, Encima stop. de it's primera clase. They're therapeutic. 
You know, I use them scientifically. Científica no es metiéndosela por la nariz, amigo. I just can't fathom it. You, of all people, why would you? They're psychedelics. Safer than riding a bus, you know. I, I take them to broaden my mind. Eso también decía Maradona. Where are you getting them from? Oh, so the stuff shirt is taking an interest, huh? You want some too? Try one of mine if you like. Stop joking around. I'm dead serious. Who sold these to you? Oh, you wouldn't believe the things I've seen, Nini. A bizarre city in the middle of the desert with strange beings with, with red and green skin and a huge flower with glowing walls. Ah, <laughs> trippy, huh? His name, Dad. Calls himself Spider. He was very easy to find. I looked him up online at the library. Here, I'll write down his phone number. Mm, vale, este es mi, mi amante. Dad, I've got to go. Don't do any more of those. Promise. All right. Off you pop. No me va a ser ni puñetero caso. Es mi padre, al fin y al cabo. No tiene por qué, ¿no? ¿Cuánto dinero se gana esta señora? Se gasta esta señora en taxis. En paraguas no, pero en taxis. Joder, hermano. Anda. Can I help you? <sighs> Hello. I don't think we've met before. You're Wendy, aren't you? Right. I'm Mina, your dad's friend. I know who you are. Oh. Good. Well, going anywhere nice? Nope. Okay. Well, I better go. It was lovely to meet you. Sure. I like your wedding ring, by the way. Hey, you. Didn't expect to see you today. Did you tell your daughter I'm married? Is that a problem? Has she asked about me? I don't keep secrets from her. She's a grown-up girl. Yeah, well, maybe I shouldn't get involved. Do you think she'd at least appreciate it if I just tried to avoid her from now on? Uh, probably not. <laughs> no need to sugarcoat it. Anyway, you gonna invite me in? Bueno, creo que ya hemos visto otra conexión. Poco a poco se van conectando todas las historias, todos los personajes. Eh, esa araña. Hmm. Hello, Mr. Spider. Good to meet you. How are you? Y no es el Spider-Man que a nosotros nos gusta. I got your number from a friend. Mira, aquí está. I'm looking for some gear. Oh, I don't esto, know esto es lo que ocurrió about. en el primer episodio. Cuando estaba triste, ¿no? Ah, oh, well, oh, If you're not interested in my money, I'll have to find that other thing. Come to the alley of Cherry Tree Lane. In about 30 minutes. Mola, 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 mola. Seguramente no lo estaré, pero bueno. Algo va a ocurrir aquí. Algo malo. <risa> ah, 
A ver, tú, niñato. You the bird on the phone? Your spider. Yeah, we doing business or what? Jesus, what are you playing at? You do all your deals around the back of a primary school? Anyway, this little business, it's over. No more dealing, no more clients. You're done. Find another profession. <laughs> you what? A bit thick, aren't you? Which part do you want me to repeat? Or do you need it handwritten in block capitals? Maybe I can email it to you. Got some mouth on you. Jog on, love, before I take it to heart. Love? You better listen to me, love. I know your number. I know what you look like. And have I at any stage given you the impression that I'm intimidated by you? You serious? Ojito. Muy bien. Las palmas sudorosas indican que es la primera vez que sujeta una espada, o sea, un cuchillo. La longitud de la espada es corta. Es corta. Y la espada es Roma. El agarre débil indica que es fácil de desarmar. Eh, tiende a encorvarse, así que su equilibrio será malo. Seguramente la causa sea la falta de ejercicio anaeróbico. Mal enfoque en cuanto a la higiene bucal. Manchas amarillas en los dientes y los labios que indican abuso de nicotina. Puede ser un oponente débil mentalmente. Fuerza física pobre en general. Inconsistencia en la masa muscular entre los dos brazos, lo que sugiere un abuso de la masturbación. Olor acentuado en las axilas, lo que indica nerviosismo crónico. Nivel de amenaza patético. Ow, ow, yeah, that's my arm. <sighs> Gavin Briggs, flat 114, Oriel House, the Villas. Very nice. You've done well for yourself. Hopefully this gets my point across. What do you think, Gavin? Yeah. What was that? Yes, absolutely. I'm gonna hang on to your license. So make sure you stay out of trouble. You wouldn't want me appearing on your doorstep, would you? You're crazy. Who the hell are you? I'm your worst nightmare. Pray that you need never set eyes on me again. Ni tan mal, oye. <ríe> bueno, no hemos tardado tanto, ¿no? No woman disrespects Spider. You've got bare bad things coming your way. Bueno, con la arañita. Se acabó. Si no me devuelves mi carnet de conducir, voy a meterte la chorla en la cabeza en Vale, no sé llegué a tiempo, ¿no? Es que no me fijé en la hora que era. What? You know, all the extra work you've been doing. You should be getting paid overtime for working so hard. So late. Why do you always have to work late, Mum? <laughs> I feel like I'm being ganged up on here. Mum has a really important job. It's like a big competition where the best win. And Mum is the best. You're the best as well. Es como si, como sa. ¿Qué significa eso? Significa que es pasado tu hora de dormir. Oh, ¿really? Yep. Come on, Dylan. I'll tuck you in. Oh, Dad, can't you do it? Listen to your mum. It's fine. Good night, Dylan. 
A ver, yo entiendo que la señora pues trabaja demasiado. Bueno, aparte de hacer cositas fuera del trabajo, ¿no? Pero... Joder, el chiquillo es un poquito... Forillo de cojones. Hughes, you didn't disappoint. I had a look through your examination results. They're very strong. Gracias. That's great to hear. When do we get started? Not quite yet. I want to give Amy another shot. We're going to do another round of interviews. Holines. Just... What? But she has next to no experience. I'm your lead on this. This assignment means a great deal to me. There's a long personal history attached to this. You can understand why I want to be absolutely sure I have the right person. Come on, man. Yeah, I understand. But you found them. She's standing right here. I'm not afraid of a little competition. Okay. Bring it on. There she is. Me da que aquí se acaba el capítulo. Efectivamente. Bueno, a ver, vamos con con Dona. Que no es la hija de Previously on last stop. De Felix, pero I keep seeing him bring him home to the girls, but I've not seen Así one of them leave. Let's follow him. Posible que la veamos. Holy shit. En este capítulo es posible. Legit. Muy buena Santiago, bienvenido. Help. We need to move him. Let's get him inside out of sight. Where the hell are you? El prisionero. Peligro desconocido. Capítulo 2. Sinceramente, no sé cuántos capítulos tiene el juego. Cada personaje. No lo sé. Tampoco sé los logros. No lo he buscado, no lo he mirado. Estamos a pelo. Sin ningún tipo de info. ¿A dónde voy? ¡Que me atropellan! Sí, el juego, el juego está chulo. El juego está chulo. Pero normalmente, pues eso, me gusta estar informado siempre. Bueno, un poquito, si es posible. No de la trama ni nada de eso, sino de no sé cuántas misiones va a haber o cuánto dura. El juego creo que dura unas cuatro horas aproximadamente. Right. This is not on. You told Mum you'd text her. You didn't. You said you'd be at the Vex house. You weren't. We were worried about you, Donna. Is everything okay? Just a moment, Ashley. Oh, amor de Dios, que... Where the hell were you, Donna? Exigente, where are your friends? No? What prevented you giving us even a courtesy text? Relájate, coño. I'm so sorry. I I'm really sorry. Madre mía, Dios I santo. I come out here this late. I have work in the morning. Mum's got enough on her plate. You were out with Vivek again, right? Where is he? Madre de Dios. 
I don't know. I wonder how the Vex dad feels about his son staying out all hours. Why don't I ask him while we're here? I bet he'll appreciate me knocking on his door in the middle of the night. We shouldn't bother the Vex dad. He's poorly. He's got, um, gingivitis or something. Babe, it's pretty late. Perhaps we should all just go home. Oh, perfect. My fiance's taking your side now. I don't know what's happened with you, Donna. You're always in your head. You're never at home. You never help around the house. Okay, I get it. I'm a total screw up. Are you happy now? Let's just talk about this in the morning. Fine. I've done all I can. You two can sort it out amongst yourselves. I know Em can come on a bit strong at times, but she loves you. She has your best interests at heart. I know, Ash. Can we please just drop it, though? You seem a bit anxious. Has something happened? I'm fine. I'm not your sister. I'm not going to ask where you were. But you can always tell me if you're in trouble. I promise. Nothing to worry about. Oh, there's Oak. <laughs> I love your sister, Donna. I just want us all to be safe and get along. Happy and safe. Got it. You're sure nothing happened tonight? There's nothing wrong? A hundred percent. Okay. Let's get ourselves home before I get a scolding too. Madre mía. ¿Qué, qué novia más buena tiene mi hermana? Por cierto, ¿alguien se acuerda de cómo se llamaba la chica que tenía el mismo uniforme que yo en el capítulo anterior? Porque todavía estoy pensando en el nombre. Pero no, no... No me acuerdo. Ya son las... 4 de la mañana casi, ¿eh? Y no, no me responden. Joder. Algo no va bien. Me da que se montaron un trío y... Y bueno, pues también... Pues, yo qué sé, los abdujo o algo por el estilo, como hace con todas sus conquistas sexuales el, el señor Calvo. Esta, Wendy. Esta, ¿veis? Esta era. Esta. ¿Dónde estoy yo? Pues es. Ah, vale, estoy allí. Es Wendy. Esa era. Esa era. Voy por la carretera, chicos. La vida son dos días. Deja que vaya por la acera. No sé que me vayan a atropellar y acabe los juegos con un final secreto y nuevo. Are going out together. I thought they were already seeing each other. No, they've been seeing each other for a bit, but now they're actually going out. Bill's such a player. I wonder how long that will last. Hey, been trying to text you all night. We had to go off the grid. I smashed my phone so they couldn't use my GPS. My phone's out of battery. How did it go with your sister? Oh, she's fine, don't worry. How was it last night? Has he said anything yet? Not a peep. He just sat there staring at us. Pretty weird. I didn't dare sleep. I don't trust Viv's not tying skills. Hey! I can't believe how tired I am. Did you bring any food? How can you think of food right now? We've been here all night. I'm pretty hungry too. Okay, let's get some supplies. We could do with tying the fella up a bit more securely. Sounds good. I could do with a second breakfast. I'll come with. 
Hang on, that's bullshit. You just got here. How about you stay and me and Viv go? It's cool. I'll watch him. You both go and bring back some food and some zip ties or something. Oh. Yeah. Sure. Come on already. I'm getting hangry. ¿Por qué nuestro amigo se quería quedar con el calvo sexy el solo? Ellos dos solos. ¿Por qué se? So, you and Vivek stayed up the entire night. What did you get up to? Didn't mention anything about me to your sister last night, yeah? No, I told you. Emma's fine. Just it was self-defense, yeah, and he's not dead or anything, so it's not even a crime really. Becky, I didn't say anything. It was Viv's idea to tie him up, and if you hadn't got stuck on that fence or whatever, we wouldn't even be in this situation. That is lucky, eh? Mr. Hughes is gonna kick off if we have much more time off school. Screw school, it's the least of our problems. So what are we getting again? Some stuff to tie the guy up with and some sort of weapon. Yeah, uh, why don't you leave the talking to me? As if I would actually say it like that. Bueno, vamos a comprar unas bridas. No creo que tengan aquí ningún tipo de comida, pero bueno, más que sea, tenemos ya las bridas. Hi, can I have a Stanley knife, uh, a roll of duct tape? No es para ningún juego sexual moderno, ¿vale? Tranquilo. How old are you? You two be in school. It's a teacher training day. Mm, right. Wear your school uniform every day, do you? Como los japoneses. Do you really care, mate? Come on. Firstly, no, not really. But I do care about going to prison. You're not buying this knife, you're too young. Dicker. Really? Out. Vale. Oh, it's fine. I nicked all that stuff. Tampoco hay que ser tan groseros. Vale, no, no. Hace falta que seamos tan mala gente. Let's not hang about. I'm not exactly thrilled about walking around town with all this murder stationery on us. Oh, quiero entrar ahí. Anda, este tiene cara. Mr. Hughes. What are you two doing here? Anda. Why aren't you at school? Anda, este es mi mi marido cuando somos la 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 mujer adulta. We could ask you the same question. Bold. Don't back chat to me. You two are in a lot of trouble. Hang on a second. Oh, for Pete's sake. Family problems. Look, I don't have time for this. Just. Get back to school and we'll talk about this another time. Too close. You've got crap chat, that's your problem. Piss off. I got us out of that, didn't I? Yeah, well done. Come on, let's just get some food and go back. A por una hamburguesa. Vamos. What? Yeah, he's a sweetie. Would it be weird? I don't know. Might be a bit weird. Las dos van a tener una pelea de gatas por el muchacho. But opposites can attract, can't they? And I could use a good roll around. Meow. What's up? You've gone quiet. I'm fine. Don't be weird. What's going on? Sorry. Still feeling pretty tired. You're tired? I'm running on fumes here. Shit! We forgot to get Viv anything to eat. Oh, just don't mention it to him. He's probably forgotten anyway. ¿Cómo se le va a olvidar si no come desde la tarde del día anterior? ¿Y cómo de verdad se les ha olvidado hey, eso? ¡Oy! No worries. Probably should head back anyway. I'll get food at home. If it's any consolation, we did manage to get hold of a box cutter and a bunch of cable ties. Okay. I guess we can tie him up a bit more securely. Okay, he's not going anywhere for now. ¿Y por qué no? 
Uh, bueno, ya, ya es tarde. Can we be sure he won't bust out of these restraints? Who knows what he's capable of? Yeah, but these are double thick zip ties. I really need to go. Me too. Need to figure out a good excuse where I've been on the way home. I'll walk with you. Donna, you okay staying here while we're gone? Yeah. You go get some sleep. We'll be back as soon as we can. I just need to make an appearance for Dad. Did he say anything while you were looking after him? Nope. I did try talking to him, but not a word. Hey, hot stranger. We're going now. Please don't eat our friend. I'll see you both later then. Bye, Donna. Come on, Viv. Tío, tenían que haberlo soltado desde hace rato. O sea, cuando lo dejaron inconsciente, vale, meterlo aquí y bueno, cuando se despertara, pues que se despertara, pero nos hubiéramos ido, no, no nos hubiéramos quedado a que se despertara. Ya está. Oh, this is stupid. We should have just called the police last night. Probably would have got away with a caution, maybe an asbo at most. But I think that ship sailed now, hasn't it? What do you think? Oh, come on, say something. Just so I know you don't have brain damage. Or is that your tactic? To throw me off guard? Yeah, that's your plan, isn't it? To hope that I'll feel guilty and set you free. All right, well, I'll just amuse myself then. Is Becky your friend? Oh. Después de 24 horas, ha hablado por primera vez. Ah. So you can speak. And apparently, you know Becky. Is Becky your friend? Yeah. I mean, do you know Becky? Of course. Oh, you do? She hit me. She's why I'm with you now. Oh, I see. Hang on a minute. She was acting in self-defense. She was protecting Dios, me. Cuánta brida compraron, amigo? You must think I was born yesterday. I would have asked your friends last night, but they were too deep in their own conversation. <sighs> what were they talking about? My legs are stiff. All right, fine. You can walk around for a bit, but no funny stuff. And try speaking more normally I can try All right Keep your hands where I can see them No funny business No puede mover las manos está 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 atado Quítale un pie nada más Y que vaya la pata coja, ¿sabes? No sé Ya está, ya con eso está bien, ¿eh? Muy bien. So, what were Becky and Vivek talking about? They were very animated with each other. That's a little vague. This matters to you, doesn't it? We had a deal, remember? Do you find it difficult opening up to people? What is this therapy? Please, I'm getting enough of that from my sister. Emma? How'd you... You mentioned her last night. <sighs> Bit nosy, aren't you? I'm interested. Joder, a ti te interesan todas las mujeres. Y bueno, y hombres. No sé por qué. That's the sort of thing Emma would say. 
Recordemos que el tío le brillan los ojos, ¿vale? Verde y no es normal. O sea, no, no parece muy humano. Habla de una forma rara. Bueno, habla porque piensa que, que no había hablado en 24 horas. Solo nos miraba. You'd be better on your own. What are you saying? I think I would like to sit down now. All right. Can I ask you a question? Of course. Last night. When you made the water glow. What was that? I enjoyed our talk earlier. Stop trying to change the subject. If you promise not to tell anyone, maybe I could show you. Sounds good. Let's see it. Come a little closer. Hey. Come on, what are you waiting for? Uh, are you all right, Donna? He was just about to show me his superpowers, weren't you? Okay. Getting a little weird in here. So now you've gone quiet all of a sudden? Because of Becky? Don't worry, she's not going to hurt you. Stop pissing around. It's not funny. We're in some real shit here, Donna. Fine, don't believe me then. Is Viv on his way? No, I texted to say he was in shit with his dad. I hope he's okay. How long are we going to keep this up? Moise is throwing a sick house party tonight. Everyone's going to be there. I guess we should properly talk it through when we're all here. I gotta go, Becky. I'll be back tomorrow. La verdad es que esta situación es jodidamente extraña. Tienen a un adulto encadenado, bueno, encadenado, ¿no? Atado. ¿Esta, esta piba vive aquí o qué? Oh, hope mom's okay. Sorry I'm late. I had to stay after school. Okay, well, I think I'll go straight to bed. I'm shattered. How was school today? Yeah, good. I thought if you had to stay late, you must have had detention. No, nah, not detention. I just decided to do my homework in the library instead. Where's your school bag, Donna? I don't know. ¿Por qué responde siempre I don't know? Oh, I see you've decided to grace us with your presence. Qué mal me cae la hermana, de verdad. She's been doing her homework at school. Apparently. Madre mía, es tan... Tan estricta, pero muy estricta. Mom, okay. She's fine. By the way... Thanks for cooking dinner tonight. We all really enjoyed it. But why is she in bed then? I said she's fine. Uh, perhaps give your sister some space this evening, Donna. Look, I just asked if Mum was okay. Why are you on my case about it? I have enough to worry about without dealing with you again tonight, Donna. You're late home again. After all the palaver of last night. I was revising for my GCSEs with Vivek. I, I thought you said you were doing your homework. It's always Becky and Vivek beginning to think they matter more to you than your own family. Oh, sick of this. I'm going out. Where are you going? Oh, none of your damn business! 
Si es que ellos se lo buscan. ¿Qué, qué son, tío? Madre mía, son muy pesados. Specs, leave a message. Damn. ¿Otra vez sin batería? No me lo creo, es imposible. Me da que se viene una F rara. La liberación del calborota. La secuestración de nuestra amiga. Es posible. Una buena forma, Julián, de, de mandar besos y a la par también saber quién está por aquí viendo el directo apoyándolo. Pues tengo que decir que el juego este me está gustando bastante. ¿eh? Me gusta la trama, me gustan los gráficos, me gusta la banda sonora, me gusta eh, los planos que usan. Me gustan bastante. Está muy bien, eh. Muy bien. What are you doing back here? Obviamente no a todo el mundo le gusta este tipo de juego tan bueno, que solo hay que pulsar para responder. Change your plans. You can go to Moise's party. Seriously? Yeah. Go and have fun. Awesome. Anything interesting happened while I was gone? Nah. You heard from Viv? I wonder if he can make Moises too. Dunno. I'll give him a call. Phone working now then. What? Me da que el calvo con su calvicie inhibe las llamadas. I tried calling you earlier. Oh, right. Yeah, I'd switched it off ah, to bueno, es que lo tenía apagado la pinche perra mardita. ¿En serio? ¿Ha apagado una, una adolescente? ¿En serio? We should probably leave our phones on at all times from now on. Okay, cool. See you later. You seem upset. I don't want to talk about it. Is it your sister? What did I just say? I thought we could continue our conversation from earlier. <sighs> okay. Let's get some things straight here. I'm not your mate. We're not going to be friends at the end of this. So you should be careful about pissing me off right now. Unless you want to see the bottom of that pool. I understand. It's better for both of us if we don't say anything more now. Donna? Oh. This is my knife. You asked me a question yesterday. You could have escaped. What are you still doing here? You wanted to see what it is that I can do. Do you still want to see? Yes. Then loosen my Esto no va a acabar bien. ¿Cómo se quitó la ropa tan rápido? Lo de las alas también impresiona, impresiona bastante. Pero lo de la ropa... Ash, what are you doing here? I, I had a suspicion you were keeping a secret. I was worried about you. It's not what it looks like. It it's just a game. So I followed you down here. Waited outside to see if you'd come out. For a moment, and we can sort this out. I need to get Emma. Ash, wait! Oh my god, someone stop her! Please, Ash! 
Stop a second. I can explain everything. Es una rata. No era una rata. El teléfono en el suelo, clásico. Eso me lo esperaba. Eso no me lo esperaba. <risa> ¿Qué? No a entender, no a mí no a entender. Bueno, pues campeones, creo que por aquí ya va siendo hora de ir terminando con el directo. Espero que, que os esté gustando el juego. La verdad, si es así, pues cuento con vuestro like. Si lo estáis viendo en YouTube, con algún comentario también. Así el vídeo se pone un poquito más animadito. Y si no estás suscrito, pues ya sabes que si no quieres perderte ningún vídeo de este o de cualquier otro juego, la suscripción es la mejor opción. En, en la descripción tendrás mis redes sociales por si quieres seguirme por ahí, que a veces pongo cosas, pues, no sé, interesantes, ¿vale? En Twitter y en Instagram. Y también encontrarás la playlist junto al canal de Twitch por si quieres ver los vídeos en directo. Campeones. Eh, nos vemos mañana, si todo va bien y no hay ningún problema, y aunque Carazor no me puedo ir, pues suerte en la operación Carazor, lee mis labios, suerte en la operación. Adiós.